Yoga Sutta Swam 16, that Param Purusha Kyateri Guna Vaitrishnam, higher renunciation is indifference to the Gunas themselves, distant from the perception of Purusha. So, so we can uh, try to renounce, renounce the war, world or renounce the sense object. But higher than this is one, when one becomes indifferent to the Gunas, Gunas are the building energies of the material nature. And this is only possible by rising above the Gunas. And rising above the Gunas means that we reach the perception of the self, spirit self. And then we, that's the state of Kaivalya, Kaivalya is indifference. Then we are not anymore identifying with this. <clears throat> And three modes of material nature, sattva, rajas, and tamas. And uh, then one is naturally, you can say one is naturally renounced in that sense, because there's no identification with the, mat uh, with the matter anymore. One is naturally indifferent to the matter. Otherwise, if you practice the, uh, try to renounce the matter, that's artificial in that sense. It may be necessary sometimes, but it's artificial in that sense that it's, we, we still identify, but now we just try to disconnect artificially from the sense object so that we can, we can uh, cease to identify with the sense object. But when one, one rises about the Sattva, Rajas, and Tamas, three Gunas, and perceive the self, then that's natural renunciation, natural state of Kaivalya, Yoga Sutras, Kitai.